All right, welcome back. Star Wars Race Incorporated. And Lorex 7. Got the it's Monday, 29th of August. Just about a month before the runoffs. Here we are. USA, baby. Let's go. So, got an update here. This is only going to go to my YouTube channel. Uh, but yeah, pretty good update. Stayed up last night working all kinds of little details, just working ahead of the engine arrival coming back and just prepping everything. So, uh, if you guys remember, the tranny had a her line cracked going as you can see all the way there. So, you know, definitely, and the tranny is good though. I've, it's very strong. I, I don't have any issues with it, so I wanted to definitely keep it for the runoffs. Uh, also, instead of trying to mess around with it, I'm not a transmission guy by any means. So, so yeah, just uh, I was thinking I was gonna do some aluminum welding myself, but no, definitely no. This is a biggie in terms of you know safety, um, things like that. You know, reliability, of course, but safety. I'm always thinking more safety first, right? So yeah went down to my local guy here in the homestead area and he took care of awesome aluminum welding both sides since the transmission was out then obviously you could do outside and inside so that thing is reinforced beautiful already did a test fitting with the uh, flywheel there and the clutch so you can see they're attached just to make sure that was all went in all the way with the starter also there so you know just the fitting of it had to shave a little bit right in the very front just you know it didn't really have to but i decided to shave just a little bit the rest of it the flywheel it's in front of it so no problem at all so really happy with that then i proceeded to deep clean this baby all the grease really oil from the engine all removed really happy came out real good still drying up a little bit but yeah, all the grease is out, you know. So really happy with that. Also, last night, uh, clean all the parts. Everything's clean now. Uh, starter got deep clean. Uh, water pump, flywheel. That thing was black. I mean, it looks really good now. Uh, engine stand, of course, and the pulley for the water pump uh, had a had, had rub against something. So I went ahead and clean it very important clean the grooves especially if you had a problem i had uh which i had oil spitting all over the engine bay so clean the grooves because obviously if it's oily uh same thing for the pulley on the alternator which i also cleaned it wasn't that dirty but clean it up too but put a special attention on the pulley clean that up real good with degreaser first and then a nice round of of um, brake cleaner so yep transmission is good got my shaft here i haven't cleaned it up yet i'm going to got some of the other nuts and bolts from the transmission and other nuts and bolts also cleaning that up real good degreasing and brake cleaning everything every bolt every everything i'm cleaning uh, some of these needed to be degreasing stuff but also i need to remove the uh <clears throat> the thread locker on some of these so i'm gonna do that this i'm gonna clean and also grind it so nice and silver i may paint it silver i don't know and there's the engine bay looking empty baby so now we're gonna i'm gonna go in there underneath and in the tunnel clean that up really really good also there's gonna be no grease in this car no oil so i'm really excited really happy with that so i'll rock and roll with that here shortly i want to do a little update first and just getting things prepped for when the engine comes in maybe this weekend maybe early next week and by that time everything will be back in here header will be back in transmission you know i'll probably mount that tomorrow i'm gonna just work on cleaning the stuff here and then i'll then i'll mount it again tomorrow but we're looking good I also my axles i went ahead and removed the protection that comes on the oem car and that way they're ready to go here in case i need them all good to go there so that's all done had to be a little creative with that it was a little difficult to cut 
terms of the angle. Also, oh, the tires, the, the tires came out real good. So I'm gonna, the other ones I have red, so I'm gonna do the same thing, just paint the inside black and uh, make it look nice, baby. All, all these bolts also have been cleaned already. So we're looking good. We're moving ahead rather nicely. And uh, she had the engine back, like I said, here in this weekend, or early next week. We'll put that on. And then we're ready to paint. You know, that's be basically about it. So that's what's going on here for the prep for the runoffs. Feeling better again. You know, I was a little down <laughs> after, you know, I had to take the engine out and take the transmission out. But now, you know, you just got to keep plugging away and then... Things just kind of, you know, you start plugging away, you do one, and then do two, and then do three, and, you know, now I took care of this today, it's nice and clean, it's ready to go back in, so I'm feeling real good now, I'm feeling real good. So that's what's going on here, you guys stay safe, stay healthy, this is Star Wars Racing Incorporated.